Feed the neighborhood with a tailgate ready big bow box. And it's bow time. JMU ended their home invitational against Fairleigh Dickinson on Saturday with a final score of 8 0. The team started out strong with a three run lead in the bottom of the first with runs scored by Hannah Shiflett, Hallie Hall, and KK Mathis. You know, when you have three going in the first, you kind of you're a little bit at ease. Um, and I think that's, you know, just having the momentum the whole game is very important. The Dukes were able to pick up the pace, scoring three runs in the bottom of the fourth and two runs in the bottom of the fifth. Junior pitcher Alyssa Humphrey was able to hold the Knights through the whole game, allowing no hits and no runs. This is the first time in a long time I felt w all the way around. I just felt really good with everything. I thought my changeup was on. Uh, I thought my rise was definitely jumped today, but I'm really proud of my teammates for having my back defensively and especially offensively, letting me to get out of this game in five innings. Humphrey pitched a perfect game, which hasn't been done on the Duke's mound since Odyssey Alexander pitched against Delaware in the 2021 CAA Championship. This doesn't happen very often. Like This is a really big deal, and I'm just trying to cherish this moment. Humphrey is the sixth player in JMU history to achieve a career record of 350 strikeouts and currently has 100 strikeouts this season. There's not many times um, in, in this sport, especially in this day and age with the offenses, the way the offenses are, that pitchers are throwing perfect games, um, and it's a historical moment for Alyssa. It's her first ever one. As a junior, she now owns 33% of the program's no-hitters, having five of her own. As she leads the team through the rest of the season, they look forward to being back at home, facing off against George Mason on March 22nd. The perfect game, I think, is just going to hold a special place in my heart. Reporting from the dugout for Breeze TV, I'm Sam Reinard.